I hit record and I still haven't figured out exactly what I want to open up from the wall yet today. You would already know from the thumbnail of the video, but uh, I'm still debating in my head. <laughs> it's Father's Day today, so I'm trying to treat myself and do something that I'll enjoy since we are celebrating all the fathers in the little collecting community. So I'll wish all you guys out there a happy Father's Day as well. Congratulations on not going bankrupt and also having a collecting hobby while having some kids. You know it would be fun? I've got a bunch of these crispy and crunchy international packs of the classic original Go Go's Crazy Bones series. Now that is some fun right there. So I think I found my winner. The international packs are a lot of fun that you can get so many more colors than we already had. I mean, we had just a massive variety of colors from the classic series, but the international gave us even more. So there's some really cool eggies and stuff we could be looking for, just some more unique colors and lots of cool jellies to be found. So let's open some up. Oh, the international crazy bone packs, 100% authentic as it can be seen on the package itself. These guys, like I said, crunchy as hell. But so, so cool. Let's see, the game you collect and the collecting you play, what? Can't read upside down, play with. The game you collect and the collection you play with. A little catchphrase by the nice international packs, or as some people say the European packs, I believe as well, but these were just the, you know, overseas one more than just the US, the World Crazy Bones Association. Oh my gosh, these things are loud. Magic Back Toys. I think we get, how many do we get in here? We get a few more, don't we? I think we get four Crazy Bones in each pack. So don't worry, we've got a bunch of them here to go over. Let's move them out of the way for now. I guess we will see what we can find in our first pack. I cannot wait to see what we can find in these things. I'm really excited. Let's do one and see what we can find in this one here. This ripped very easily, holy crap. The World Crazy Bone Association little card. It's got all our games on it. Traditional game, Crazy Bone Basket. And we've got our nice little big stickers, big ticket stickers here. Cool dude. We got the froggy top hat. No, cowboy, cowboy, double cowboy. Okay, double cowboy. Let's see what our first pick is here. We've got reggae in a very dark, like, dark green almost. Huh, very dark green. Bring the camera down a little bit. But let's see what we've got here. We've got... Not music, what is your name again? Or are you music? Oh, I can't remember. Dang it. But a nice solid blue, just a simple solid one. And I only see one more, so maybe we only get three in each pack, which makes sense. Oh yeah, heavy metal, looking slick. We got a nice ice. A nice ice is a great way to start it with the first pack. That's a good one. Very clean looking figure. I thought for a second it had glitter in it, but it does not. It's just very, very ice. Now, what's the main goal for today? I think I would love to find a tie-dyed. I know that's going to be hard to do, but I really would love to pull a tie-dye one of these days. That would be incredible. We got the checklist here, and we've got stickers coming out here. Biker. We've got Funny Bone. Oh, frick. I can't remember. Frog Boy Dude. I don't know. He's not Frog. Definitely not Frog. He Dumby or something. Whatever, let's see what we got in this one. Oh baby, look at that banger. Oh my gosh, that is an awesome toothpaste. That is really clean. A green, wow, that toothpaste looks super good. And see, this is what I'm talking about, man. You can get such a nice variety with these international packs. Uh, besides the tie-dye, obviously, we gotta go for eggies, you know? We gotta get some eggies in here. What is your name? Oh man, I'm losing my mind, forget, excuse me guys, you know, it's, I'm not trying to use my head today. It's Father's Day, I'm trying to just chill. Ooh, oh, we got a whistler though. Ooh, a very weird looking yellow with a weird mold, but it is a whistler right on his schnozzola, as you can see, very tiny hole. Weird. I've never seen a hole that tiny for a whistler. That is funny. Not an impressive mold though. Not an impressive color for this yellow. I went and got my checklist cheat sheet so I can actually start picking up the names again because I just got to do a little refresher here. You know what I mean? Let's move a little quicker though. Let's get another one out. See what we can find in this one. All right. So eggy. Yes, we want to find an eggy. I would prefer to find the nice purple eggy. That would be a really good one to get. What's our first one in this? We've got a hot pink looking E.T. mother fricker. 
Let's go. Nice. What's the next one? Bring it out. Bring it out. Ooh, another ice for music. Very good. Oh, ah, yes, man. The ice. I need to get a whole set of ice. I think I got to be pretty close from that one big, huge lot that I got from eBay. I got to be getting close to a whole thing of the ice ones. Very, very close. Last one in here, we've got this tepid kind of sky baby blue for Sly Boy. Not Sly Boy. What are you? Junior. Junior. I forgot about your name, Junior. Okay. Here we go. We've got another one. Let's get into it. These packs are pretty hard to come by. They are more expensive if you try to go hunt for them on eBay, typically. Uh, I've seen some decent deals on them, but nothing too crazy. I got lucky with my packs, uh, but if you know if you hunt long enough, ooh, a jaw sticker, very good. If you hunt long enough, though, I'm sure you will find a decent deal. But now we've got Sly Boy, that's Sly Boy for sure, and we've got like a little gray one of him. Again, the molds are are so different; they're not as clean from these packs, actually. Ooh, what do we got? Whoa, why do we have a thing? in this pack what the heck things shouldn't be in the international packs i don't believe i don't think we should get those that was only for like the series three release i believe we would get things and whatnot but maybe that was just an awkward like packaging or something that is weird i don't believe the international had any of the things though we got the elvis man though here in another kind of gray looking thing and again the molding on these grays not as impressive as i would have liked it's interesting. It's very interesting. The backs are clean, like the numbers very clean and everything, but the front looks a little bit like blobby almost. Now this one feels like a good pack. I feel some bigger figures, so let's get this one out. We got our stickers here, biker, bad boy. That's bad boy. That's right. What's our first go-go? Whoa, let's go. And ice jaws. That is a huge hit. I love it. I love to see that. Jaws are, yeah, they don't, they're not as common to get in packs, I would say. You don't pull them too often. And I have a very limited selection of Jaws in my personal collection, even though I have so, so many from the classic series. I still only have a few Jaws. That's how crazy it is to find these guys. One of the very popular characters, obviously, people would hang on to them and stuff, but let's see what else we got here we've got cool dude very blue see this mold feels a little cleaner at least so that's good very good blue though i like this blue last one in here feels big ba bang oh we got reggae his mold does feel big oh he's got some like mold issues here too on this one huh he almost oh he could have been a goober oh a little bit longer in the batch or something and he would have been goovered up right here on the edge because it kind of got a little wonky on this side, I guess. I am still confused about this things thing. That is awkward. It's such a weird off color too. Next up, let's see it. Let's get out our stuff. Oh, they're trying to all slip out. We got Monster, we've got Goody Goody, and we got Miss Froggy. So who's going to be our first pull? We've got the Biker. No, not Biker. What is your name again? Fang? Yeah, Fang. He's got that little buck tooth. Again, in that yellow, the same one as that teacher's pet we got over here. Kind of uh, not a fan of that one, but that's okay. Oh, oh, baby, let's go. Another Jaws. That is a huge hit. And it's a white. Ooh, wait, so you got like some mold? <laughs> I don't think it's mold, but it looks like it was trying to be it's like some kind of glitter or something. It's got the weird flex of like black on it. It's very weird. Huh, that, that's awkward. Yeah, there's like not enough glitter dropped on this guy. I don't know, did they do this kind of like grayish white with black glitter? I don't know, that's weird, but I'll have to look into that one, see if I've seen anything from that. But you know these guys, you'll never find like repeats a lot of the time. It's very rare, but ooh, we've got a sleepy boy, sleepy deepy in an ice. We are just hitting these ice like crazy. That is great. That's a clean ice too. The ones without the bubbles for the ice look really good. Now, obviously you'll never get like zero bubbles, but like this one doesn't, they only have a few in the top of the head here. Uh, the rest of it's pretty straight through and that's that's a clean looking ice figure i'm gonna start separating some of our nice ice ones here crap my battery's dying i might have to plug in my phone here in a second oh no all right let's pull out these oh another interesting crazy bones authentic all these things are a little bit different all these cards 
Oh, let's get out these first. Goody, goody. There we go. Eggy. Ooh, an eggy sticker. Let's get it. Now we just got to pull the eggy, but right now we've got our little chef man here in that dark green. Who else do we got? We've got Frankie. Ooh, that's kind of a nice looking orange. I kind of dig that orange. Yeah, that's pretty sick, actually. One more hiding in here. What is it? Ooh, very, very nice. A nice, good translucent blue. That is excellent big mouth coming in clutch for a good pack overall with a nice jelly blue and 20 minutes later we're back so let's get into another pack Ooh, whoa these are just coming right out here what do we got in this one a ba bang a nice looking blue once again our stuff that i'm just gonna you know i'm just gonna see if we got any like decent stickers just smiley and stuff wow What's our next one? Ooh, yes, I'm collecting the solid black ones as a full collection. So this is a great pickup, a great hit. I wonder if I need it. I need to start marking it off somewhere so I can keep track of these. Slowly but surely, I'm doing that with all my series. I'm getting all of them checklist up and like on Excel sheets and whatnot, but it takes time. You know, I've got so many at this point now, but this is a fantastic gold glitter. Fantastic looking. This one looks Excellent. This is Babe, I think. Yeah, Babe Gold Glitter. That is sharp as heck. Very nice. Next up, let's see it. What do we got? Let's go here. We'll pull out those. We got these. Oh, yes, Joker, all that. We got Heavy Metal. I never see the artwork for this one. The artwork actually looks pretty darn clean, I would say. Let's see what we got. Ooh, Frankie in a translucent orange. That is a good hit. That is a good find. All right, we got two orange frankie so far but we need an eggy can we oh baby a glow in the dark let's get it we got the good old chub master here chubby in a glow in the dark wow this one looks like a weird off glow in the dark too like the glow in the darks come in such a variety of colors it's crazy like some of them are more white some of them are more off white this one almost looks gray but let me just check. Yep, yep, yep. It is glow in the dark. So I was right. Just want to make sure. But it does. It looks like it has this weird gray tone. It's so bizarre how many different things, even just for glow in the dark, which you think would just be like one color because it's glow in the dark. But oh, 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 man, we got a duplicate of this one. And I saw this at first. It almost got us a tie dye. There's just a splotchy little splotch of a darker blue right there on the bottom, but not everywhere. You want the tie-dye to be all over the place a little bit more. We are very close here, very close. Bring it in the other pack. Let's go. We've got the scorecard, classic, and we've got decent. Oh, we got vamp. Vamp's a decent one. I don't see that one too often, I feel like. First one up, dreamer. Let's go, and it's that wonderful toothpaste orange that is a solid hit right there it's got that marbling effect going in on the side a little bit clearer and the front just kind of looks like more taffy like not so much toothpaste but you can notice it once you turn it that's interesting that's a solid one though that's a solid hit i love the dreamer ones i always get good dreamers and we've got a silver music holy crap this pack is excellent let's go this is great looking condition too. Solid looking. That is a fantastic silver. Holy cow. I wonder if I've got her in a silver. I don't think I do. Not just the normal like toothpaste silver, but this is an excellent little pickup. Good pack so far. What do we got? One more? No? Did we already do three? Or did we get skimped on? We might have got skimped on on that one. Can't remember what our other one was if there was three. I'll have to review the tape, but I think we only got Dreamer and the silver, which is kind of crazy unfortunate but you know it happens from time to time is this a new sheet oh look at that we've got like the little cartoon little drawing thing on this one that is funny i haven't seen that yet either they got a little better with adding some nice inclusions of different insertable stuff we got an eggy again for a sticker very good what do we got here we've got sly boy in a blue did we get sly boy in a blue no, we got him in a different one, but there we go. No, no, no. This is, yeah, this is Sly Boy. This is Sly Boy. Well, just a blue. Nothing too crazy. What do we got here? Ooh, it's one of my favorite translucent jellies. The Lime Green Machine. And we got ourselves a little clown. Is this clown here? Yeah, clown. 
Very good, very, very good. That is a clean looking jelly. Nice, it's not as translucent as other ones. It's a little bit more opaque. We got another one in here though. What do we got? We got Wowza. Ooh, what is with that molding? <laughs> Look at how oh, he's got like a little chin on this one. That is too funny. I don't think that you really catch that on any of the other molds. That is hilarious, but there you go. In that kind of ugly yellow though, that mustard color. And I believe that was just, was that another twofer? What did we get? We got Sly Boy and then we got Wow? What? Oh no, we got, no, that one we got three, I'm pretty sure. Ooh, I, ooh, 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 we're spoiling, but I see some interesting colors, but I want to check this out first. Look at that little, little drawing. That's a good one. All right, let's not spoil it. We got Ghost here. That's, that's pretty slick. Goody, goody. Okay. All right, who we got? I saw this one. Let's pull this out. Okay. I thought it was more of a purple, but... It's not quite that. We got scary here. It is kind of like a purple. It's more of like a brownish purple, red kind of thing. That is an interesting one. I haven't seen that color before. What else do we got? We got cool dude. No, we got a uh, James Bone. That's right. James Bone in the sharp plain black, which again, I will take it. I'm trying to get all these. So this one looks pretty nice, pretty solid. And last one in here is a green boy, just a solid green. Very good. This one actually looks really clean. This mold, this little paint job here looks pretty solid. Very, very solid tubby. I like it. I like it. Look at how nice. Look at how, oh, this one's just prime condition that is perfect we're still going in we got a few more packs i feel like i'm just going to open all of them honestly i've got i think i got like 22 packs or something like that so we're just going to get in boy the eggy oh boy let's go that's a clean looking eggy oh that is nice freaking eggy man we got the egg boy let's check out the back a little bit here we got the egg butt very nice a solid looking blue oh i wonder if i have this one or not i want to say i don't have this in particular like royal blue i've got other blues but not this one this is a good find i wanted to zoom in a little bit i ended up zooming in halfway across the world on all my guys but oh boy look at that howdy boy eggy that is a really solid one all right we got one eggy now we need to find some more you know i'm just greedy like that i just gotta keep finding them we find one it's not enough we gotta keep going this is my least favorite character in the classic series new wave gross looking figure never liked the design never liked the mold and we've got our little chef in a very nice looking green again and so many different color tones of the green this one is one that i don't really know i've seen too often i might have one other one that's in this color but that's about it sharp let's keep going now this pack look at this pack it's missing the like silver foiling they like crimped it the machine crimped it <laughs> right on top of all this stuff which means this part yep it's got a nice crimp right on it that's from the manufacturer right there so that's interesting so i wonder if it's a, a little lucky pack Ooh, menace let's go gotta find a good menace that would be excellent nice wowza let's see what's in this weird manufacturing error pack we've got james bone in the icy dicey let's get it that is nice we've gotten so many ice holy crap how many five so far that's wild i'll take those ratios right now we're doing pretty good oh so it wasn't lucky we only got two but we did get a very very nice looking tooth pasty green but not really any marbling so it kind of just has this kind of like metally green sheen to it. If you can kind of pick that up on camera, it's a very pristine condition go-go though. I'll say that like it is glistening in this light. No problems, no scratches or anything, dings, dents. And it would technically be a toothpaste, I would say, but there's just no marbling on it. So we've got like a nice, really unique looking kind of metally green figure. That is pretty dope. Next up, let's see how we do. Ah, oh, is this a new, new artwork? Oh, it's our boy. Look at that. Perfect, perfect. I love these artworks. That's a cool little addition that we found out about these international packs. I'm sure some of you that have opened international already knew about that, but I've really, I think I maybe have opened one international, but not that many. Nice reggae. 
in that kind of uh, darker mustard orange, I guess you could say. And we've got our little fang coming in with that classic blue. We've been getting a lot of that blue. Uh, about the same blue as we've gotten ice figures, actually, which is funny. Our last one, though, we didn't get skimped on this time. We did get Smiley. Very, very dope. Very good. Sharp. Pitch black Smiley Boy. You can barely pick it up. It's just cruising in this light it almost looks like it's painted with that phantom black or phantom black whatever it's called the one that like doesn't suck up light obviously you can see it is a little bit but it is dark on the camera that is funny we've actually gotten four of the solid black so that's a pretty good ratio too let's see if we can keep up with what we got going now this one felt like a beefier pack so hopefully we get like a menace or something Sorry, the noise is just unbearable. All right, I don't know where the stickers are, so we just got our tub master. Yeah, tubby, tubby right here in that same green that we just got, actually. So that's pretty nice. Solid to find another one in that kind of more unique green color. And who else we got in here? We've got, ooh, Funny Bone. Man, oh man, it's been a while since I've actually gotten you out of a pack. I thought he was more common, but I guess not, because like, Man, since I started the channel, I've barely pulled him, I feel like. I, I've been getting him in a lot of lots, but not from the packs themselves. And it's a black. Once again, excellent, excellent find. I'm taking it. I'm taking it. Let's go. Ooh, look at that blue. Is it opaque? It almost looks like it's trying to be opaque, but I don't think it is. It's got a really nice, really nice sheen to it, though, for this type of, like, royally blue. Not one that we've seen today thus far with the blues. This is a very unique-looking blue, kind of just like that green is. Let's keep it going. What do we got in here? Yeah. On the line, game. We pull out the stickers first. Got to just get rid of these. Bang, bang, bang. Heavy metal. And what's our first one? Another one of these blues. Now, is this the same? Almost the same. It's almost the same. Oh, it's very close. I think it's closer to one of the other blues that we've gotten before, but it's still a clean figure. Hey, we've been getting a weird mix of like good molding, bad molding, and like really good painted and not as greatly painted. Uh, it's, but I would say most of these are painted pretty darn well, just for the most part, we just had like some weird molding things on a couple of them. What's in this one? Baba Booey, we got Punky Boy here in the weird like off blue, baby blue type. Not a huge fan of that, that tone, but okay. Oh, this one feels hefty as well. So maybe we got a bigger figure. I'm seeing blue again already. So many blues in here. We're missing a sticker, but that's okay. Oh, there it is. Let's pull it out. There we go. That was, wow. Okay. Let's get this blue out of the way. Ooh, four eyes in that nice sharp blue. Again, kind of similar to the blue we just got out of reggae. Not quite that weird, like, kind of, I don't know, that's just that other blue. Other weird blue. Whoa. Look at you, Miss Froggy. You are like a dark, dark, dark blue or like a dark purple almost that is a very unique one as well holy cow that is a i've never seen that dark of a blue that is really cool we're getting so many good ones backing it up with a straight up yellow the good kind of yellow just the solid bright yellow very good i'll take this one all day i don't want to see any more of the mustardy ones or anything like that those just don't do it for me but this one, I'll take this kind. I'll take it. Daydreamer is looking fresh with the nice, sharp, bright sun yellow. Here we go. Let's open this one up real carefully so I can use the... Oh, I was going to say, I want to take some pictures still. But, ooh, that's a new one too. New artwork. I forget his name. I don't remember what the mascot's name was. All right, let's just go ahead and dump these out a little bit at a time. Oh, it's another one of these weird speckled. I stopped to see if I could like actually get off any black or anything, but it's not. It's like on the figure, it's in the mold. It's just very weird that it's like this speckled black spotted Dalmatian type. Oh my gosh. Out of all the doubles we could get, that is a crazy double to get. That's insane. We got two of the same exact blue jelly eggies. Wow. That's actually pretty surprising. I'll be honest. Like, I wasn't expecting that. Out of all the eggies we could get, we got two of the same exact color. 
<laughs> that is too funny, man. This one looks pretty good. I mean, just like the other one, they're both in stellar condition. It's just crazy that we got two of these same exact eggies. That is hilarious. What do we got? One more in here? Oh, yeah, we got Daydreamer in the mustard. Uh, no thanks. I said I wanted to get it in the sun yellow. That would be much better. We're coming down to it. We've only got a few more packs left. So let's see if we can get a third blue eggy, I guess, since that's just what our luck's gonna be for us today. What do we got? We got Daydreamer, Sweetie, Babe. And our first one out is our looking cool dude in that kind of gross gray. It's fine. It's fine. We'll keep moving on. We've got the fly though in the baby blue. Again, not my favorite. And it's weird how these like pastel y dimmed down colors are all like kind of weirdly molded. They just don't look the same. It's like they use a good mold for the jellies and then they put like this crappy mold for just the regular colors. But oh, oh, that is a good speedy. It is the elongated speedy, not the fatter, squattier speedy. And it is that awesome toothpaste orange. Oh my, that one is crisp. Wow. You really do not see a lot of these oranges in toothpaste. It's very, very rare, I would say, to find this color tone. It's very hard to get. That is an excellent speedy. One of the better speedies I've gotten in a while. That is perfect. Next up, this is the last three packs that I have currently. And we've got a jaw sticker. Good sign, good sign. Let's see if it is. First up is Cool Dude. In that very, very like nice royal blue, it is a kind of a darker one. Not one we've gotten before. It's actually even different than our little heavy metal one that we got here. It looks good though. It's a good crisp one. What's the next one? Let's pull, oh, it's another ice. Monster in ice. Monster on ice. Oh, that wouldn't be a good combo. Monster on ice. Oh, snorting a little, a little snow here or something there, monster. Oh, very, very good that we got another one of these ices. You know, keep stacking them up. Keep stacking up the ices. That's fine with me. What's our last one? A purple. Wow, haven't found you before in this little lot of uh, packs. That's an interesting flavor. I think this kind of purple fits Nice Guy's uh, character quite well. It's got this kind of like pastel -y purple and it fits his vibe. This is a very cool purple though. Again, one that I just really haven't seen a lot of. So that's a, that's a good pickup as well. Anytime you get one of those unique color choices. It's very nice. It's nice to get ones that are consistent for like completing master sets of like certain colorways, but it is really cool just to find that one off color that just doesn't fit into the rest of them. The uniqueness on point with the original classic series. Let's pull out the stickers. Oh, we got our monster right there as a sticker. And what's our first one? Let's see. Ooh, let's go. Sleepy Joe coming in with the glitter. Let's get it. Gold glitter, man. Is this like a co more common one? Man, I've been seeing these pop up a lot lately, this gold glitter flavor. That's, hey, I'll take it though. They're nice. They're nice. I like them. What else we got? We got one more, two more, two more. That's right. We've got James Bone again. This has to be a Duplo, right? Didn't we get James Bone in a, in a blue? No, not quite. Not this blue. And one more. What does it be? Oh my gosh. That's freaking great, dude. <laughs> we've been getting so many of these base black ones. It's so good. And now we've got our classic cool dude looking fresh with this big old smile. And this, oh man, the freaking ice, the blacks and the blues have just been common as hell. And I'm not complaining because those are nice sets to complete. But now we've got the last pack, ah, the last pack of the International. This is a nice looking package actually. Oh man, what a bummer that this is it. Let's open it up nice and slow, nice and carefully here. Try not to split anything on this one and see what's inside. Can you guys sneak a little bit? Oh, oh, what was that? What was that? Let's find out. Oh, Tor. Dang it, man. That's a bummer. All right, now I'm showing stuff off though. Let's go in here and pull out this very unique, weird goober eyed. Is it goober eyed? Eye looks weird and bigger, doesn't it? This is Babe. And it is another one of these like very unique toothpaste, swirly marbled figures. And it's like a 
skin tone goldish type thing here. I don't know. What would, what would I describe this as? It looks very cool in person. On camera, it's kind of getting not as much depth, but in person, it looks very neat. It's got this very nice kind of like bronzy effect and it almost looks opaque in person, but I don't know if you could pick that up on the camera, but it really does look kind of opaque. And then that toothpaste is like marbling just enough to make it look really, really fire. That is a, that is a nice one. Okay, good one. Maybe I'll compare it to some other colors, but we do get one of these grays again. Now, was this one speckled with our little weirdness? No, see, this one doesn't have any speckling on it. Huh, Fang though? All right, that one's nice, that one's fine. And our last figure, who will it be? Oh. Oh, oh, I saw something decent. Let's get it here. Hot pink ghost flavoring the bubblegum pink ghost. Oh, that one's pretty. This one's kind of opaquey too. Man, I don't know how they did these, but it's pretty cool looking. <laughs> these certain type of flavors like this and this one both have kind of that same look where they're kind of opaquey and they're kind of just like very smooth looking, like very candy-like smooth, like extremely. Like this one looks like if you were just passing by it, it almost looks like it's just a piece of gum, a very polished piece of gum, but a piece of gum at that. Dang, well, there's all the guys from the international lot. That was pretty stellar. I had fun with it. We got some really, really good ones that are going to help me complete collections. These blacks, the ice, man, two eggies, but both duplicates, which is just hilarious. But hey, it's an eggie and it's an international eggie, so that's fine. We'll just go in freehand here a little bit. We'll get a nicer view of just all the ones we pulled up today. We got a couple jaws. That was excellent. I'm really happy about that. Let me know what you guys think about the rest of the polls. I think these, uh, these orange ones here are just fan-freaking-tastic. And that jaws in the ice, super nice. And even this toothpaste monster with the nice eggies next to it looks, that looks really cool. Very happy with how some of these stood out in this lot. And I still don't know what the frick was going on with this singular things go-go. Like what the heck was with that? I don't get it. That's going to do it for the video for today. If you stayed all the way to the end, I really appreciate it. While you're still here, quickly hit that subscribe and click that like button. It really helps me out. And once again, happy Father's Day to all you guys in the community that watch the videos. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Stay tuned for more openings very soon. We will see you guys in the next video.